who you are and why you're at South by Southwest. Sure, so my name is Jason Calari. I'm an astronomer at the Space Telescope Science Institute. So we're right now the headquarters for the Hubble Space Telescope, oh, cool. which has been a fantastic tool to do astrophysics for 20 years. And we're here at South by Southwest to introduce the successor to the Hubble Space Telescope, which is the next great big telescope that we're going to launch into space. So how big is the telescope that so, you're sending into space? Yeah, so the Hubble Space Telescope is about the size of a school bus, okay. right? We launched it in 1990, and it orbits the Earth once every 90 minutes. And it's been taking beautiful pictures, and it's changed our knowledge of the universe. And so it's been fantastic. But it's also opened up new mysteries. And to solve those new mysteries, we need an even more powerful telescope. Wow. So the telescope that we're, we're building, the James Webb Space Telescope, is the size of a tennis court. Okay, so I have to ask, because it looks like you're carrying like your lunch leftovers here, but I have a feeling that's not what's in there. There's actually a lot of technology in here. Can I see it? So this is... Whoa. This, this is, is the ultimate bling, Jason. This is bling. <laughs> So this is a gold-coated mirror. So this is similar to what the actual James Webb Space Telescope mirrors will be, but the actual mirrors are gonna be 21 feet across. Whoa, okay, a gold-plated so mirror? This Can is a gold I look into it? I, I see my future, see it's so weird, actually, yeah. <laughs> so the reason that we put gold on the mirror is that gold can reflect infrared light with a lot of, uh, very high efficiency. So all of the photons that hit the mirror from stars and galaxies in the universe end up making it to our cameras. This huge telescope, what, what kind of science can it do? So that's a great question. So we've got thousands of astronomers that are waiting to use this telescope for all types of science. We want to find the first stars and galaxies that formed in the universe. We want to study how galaxies evolve over cosmic time. We want to do lots of cool stuff. One of the things that I'm most excited about is that in astronomy today, we've been able to find lots of planets that are going around other stars in the nearby galaxy but we don't know if those planets have the conditions necessary for life. Wow. So what we need to do is analyze those planets and figure out what's in their atmospheres. So if we studied the Earth's atmosphere, we would see water vapor, we would see oxygen, carbon dioxide, methane, and we can find those same elements in other planets using the James Webb Space Telescope. So this telescope could potentially tell us if aliens actually exist. If there's life on other planets, absolutely. It'll bring us one step closer. <laughs> That's very cool. Awesome.